Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm Roxanne and this is my unboxing channel. I seem a little far away right now. I don't know why. Here, let's see if that makes a difference. A little bit. I think I need a higher chair or something. Anyway, I'm gonna just close that off. Okay, so I do actually have some mail today. Lux box came in today. I haven't even opened it. Look at that. Okay, just to let you know, Luxbox is a Canadian subscription company. It is $29 a month, and it also had the $10 beauty surprise this month. If you're wondering what a beauty surprise is, well, let me tell you. Beauty surprise from Topbox is, I'm going to just move closer now, is an add-on, um, sort of like what Ipsy has. Um, it comes with uh, usually a survey kind of asking what you like what you don't like not ne not always necessarily sometimes it's asking you what your colors your brow shade do you like lipsticks do you want this do you want that uh, so um, Liz Luxbox is a quarterly subscription so it comes out you know um, spring summer fall and winter um, this is the summer box this box is sold out uh, the next box that they'll be coming out with is actually the editor's box because sometimes it gets so popular that they do put that um, editor's box out and usually it's a little bit of what's in the summer box and uh, a few other things oftentimes it does not come with the add-on so don't go and buy it because you think it's going to come with the add-on because a good chance that it won't. Um, I just did my makeup and I apparently didn't put anything away. So I've got all of this stuff just like, hey, I'm right here. Deal with me. Deal with me. All right. So I just want to put some of it away just so it's not my way when I do this video. If you use my link, you don't save any money and I get a $5 off coupon. Okay. Here is the box. It is gorgeous. Simple. Understated. And it is right full. Wow. Okay. So I'll put that there. So the first item I see is the Super Tidy Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. I have had this. I have tried it. I'm not, you know, a fan, but it's not bad. I'm not sure how much that is worth, so I'm not even going to look it up. So this is Shea Moisturizer African Black Soap Soothing Body Lotion with Oats, Aloe, and Vitamin E. This will actually come in handy for this summer because, you know, we all seem, seem to dry out with the heat and uh, whatnot. So I'm glad I got that. Um, ooh, so I got a tiny sample of the Vitamin Glow. I actually was going to use that today, but... Uh, I did not. So this is a primer. This is with vitamins B, C, and E. I kind of wish they would have included the bigger size than that. Come on, Smashbox. You can send this company bigger sizes than that. So I got La Ritzy Waterproof Eyeliner. I actually don't think I have um, waterproof eyeliner, um, which is really weird because my eyes water a lot. I do have a bit of something going on with my eyes. I'm not exactly sure. So let's see what this is. Is this? Oh, it is a pen. I'm not great with pens, so um, <laughs> it kind of looks like a little woo wing on its own. It is really black, and that's already dried. Hmm. Maybe I will have to give that a try. Uh, Loritzi is actually a Canadian company, I believe, so Ooh, I got nail polish. It, this is in the color Lace Em Up. I can't tell if that's blue or... Oh, it's like a... Oops. I think it's a blue. I have nail polish on, so I'm not going to put it on right now. Um, I was really hoping for the orange. I saw somebody get the really funky orange because I like Halloween. So I will definitely use that. So um, this is Medusa's Makeup. wet to matte. A start, a start in the center of your lips. Move outwards for each corner. Blot lips. Allow to dry. So this is in the color shag. Because that sounds appetizing. Shag. 
I'm not sure what they mean by that, but hey, we'll leave it up to you to decide. I'm not feeling this box right now. Last summer they had a really great beauty surprise, so. Let's see here. Oh, that is an interesting color. It's like a neon orange. I was hoping you would look at the lipstick and not my face. Oh my god. So, I'm guessing that this will... Whoops! <laughs> I thought I dripped some of the nail polish in there. I guess I did. All right. So this is Pure Cosmetics. Okay, so this Create a Flawless Natural Looking Finish with Pure Cosmetics Refine and Perfect Loosing Powder. This weightless ultra fine powder features four complexing redefining shades that create a matte even appearance on the skin. This feels like a top box to me. There's nothing even exciting in this. Like, the nail polish? Oh, okay. Now that's kind of cool. Hmm. Okay. So, that is neat. That's like a game. I could just look at this all day. That is neat. Okay. So, all I can smell is the nail polish. I'm like, what smells? It's nail polish. Okay. So, it doesn't say how to use it. Like, My question is, oh yeah, okay, so it does have, um, it does have like colorants in it, so obvi obviously, but I just wanted to make sure, I wanted to see what they were, I'll have to look them up, up online. Obviously, this is not a... I did not put any powder on my face, so... Let's try this with my $45 brush, because remember, I got two of them at $90, so this is $45. Okay. Okay, guys, so I don't know. Can you see that? <laughs> it's like dump it all over my desk. There's still one more thing in there, so let's hope this is nice. I will be your tester. If you got this, I will let you know how it is. I was just going to put it on a... <laughs> Don't inhale it. It does not taste good. I am making a mess with this. But it comes in four colors. They should have made it smell like cotton candy. That's pretty. I showed you that last night. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's like translucent powder. It's in four different colors because, like, it does different things. Yeah. It's a mess, though. I know. I'm a mess. Okay, so we'll see how that works out for me. It doesn't actually have a bad smell. Okay. I know there's a little pod that you can use, I guess, to bake it, but do I really need to do that? Honestly, I'm just going to stay home today. I haven't been feeling very well, so. Okay, I'm going to give that a shot. I will let you guys know how that works out for me. Now that it's all over everything. I feel like it's really blurred a bit. Maybe I'm seeing things I don't know, but. Okay, so the last item. It's from Pure Cosmetics. This is Studio Palette. Okay, there's no mirror in here, is there? No, oh, there is. That was my dog sign, not me. Okay, so. I have seen this, somebody else get this. Um, whew, that is a nice mirror. I can see all my lines in there. Yep. Okay, so I'm just going to take out the... Uh, so, okay guys, there's the colors. I will definitely give this a try and see what it's like. This mirror is huge. It's really, really nice. Let's do some swatches since, you know, I'm here. Let's see what this is all about. Okay, so am I thrilled with this month's box? Not necessarily. Um, it feels like I could have bought a lot of this stuff for cheaper elsewhere um, and maybe save some money because there's some stuff I probably wouldn't have bought, like the Medusas. But with every box, you get that yes, no, maybe so. I'm not going to degrade Lux Box, but I do feel like the box has gone downhill quite a bit. Let's just hope that the, after this uh, pandemic, um, we start to pick up and we start to see some, you know, some really nice stuff. Actually, I'm going to say, I think that finishing powder did a good job. I just took some pictures before I uh, came on here because I just did my makeup and um, I'm going to release it later as um, get ready with me. Um, but I'm already seeing like looking in. Oh, that feels nice actually. So anyway, I'm going to take some pictures and see what it's what it's like. So I am going to swatch these. I'm just going to do the top row and then I'll wipe my hands and I'll do the bottom row. One, two, three, four, five, six, if I can count. So um, these are all after, I think, different um, artists. That's why it's called the studio. Okay. So we're going to start with my row. Can't really see that one. These are super creamy. Okay, so that one is Picasso. This one will be Deli. Deli? Deli. Deli. Okay, so here's a perfect pink for me. This is Warhol. 
So you can see there is a bit of fallout, but they're very, very creamy. So there's this beautiful green. And this one's, ooh, that one's Kaleo. So I'm going to use my, <laughs> my finger here. And this is Banksy. Okay, that went on really, really nice. That one is gorgeous. Um, wow, I'm, I have to say I'm a bit impressed. So let's go to the uh, shimmers here and see what I can do with those. my hands dry okay so we're gonna do O'Keefe over here Graco Monet ha! we we already screwed this up because you know this is but Bacini okay so here's Rockwell with my thumb And then Van Gogh. Whoa! Guys, this is not what I actually expected. I'm actually not minding the pigment off of this. So I did my makeup already, which I'm kind of disappointed. I used the Nomad uh, palette, which I absolutely love. Don't get me wrong. I really like my eye look. But um, I did see other people getting this palette, but I was like, oh, it's just going to be garbage. So I'll just swatch it and I'll just pass it on to somebody. But this blue is just beautiful. I am not a blue person. It's got a dark of a, a, a bit of a black. There's really, oh, I'm ex actually excited to use this one and the Bot Sally. I think we'll use those two together. Oh my, <laughs> you guys, I don't swear on camera. I rarely ever swear on camera. I swear at work all the time. I swear in the house all the time. Like my kids know me, I swear. But I know when to keep a proper mouth. Um, I try not to swear in front of my, my, my in-laws. And my mother-in-law watches this. Um, my mom knows I'm a swear. <laughs> and I have to admit, I'm pretty impressed with this. Is anybody else going to be impressed with this? I don't know. But personally, I, I think for 10 bucks, I, I might not, it might not be so bad. Is it a Jeffree Star? No. <laughs> Is it a Nomad? Maybe. This may actually find a home in my, um, in my, my collection. So I'm going to, when, after I release this video, you were going to see a follow up using some of the items from this. Um, maybe I'll redo my nails before I do this video. I'm going to try doing this video soon. But man. Man, oh man, oh man. I really am surprised by how creamy these are. I know I'm going on. I'm sorry, guys. But, like... I want to play with this Van Gogh. I want to take off my makeup right now and do it. Okay, so honestly, maybe this pure, I mean, they they seem to have some good products. I, I mean, I'm really liking how, like this is what reminds me of when I use my It Cosmetics No no More Pores or Bye Bye Pores. I find that uh, I, my skin feels really soft, like, you know, like there's no makeup on it. So I really, really like it. I, I got to do... Ugh. Now, the bottom one doesn't look so, like, well, I guess, yeah, it does. But holy moly. Maybe I'll just play in this all day. That has some, wow. Okay, guys, I'm just going to end it here. Uh, 
did I get my money's worth? I'm not sure. I believe this actually retails for about $30 on their site, and I believe this retails for $30 on its site. Um, it didn't give me a card, so I'm not 100% sure, and I really don't want to look it up right now because I might buy more stuff. Um, so, yeah. Um, and now it does give you some eye looks at the back that you can do, and it does tell you all the colors. I could have sworn I seen this somewhere because that Monet, where is it here? Yeah, yeah, the Monet. I know I have seen somewhere. So it says the Starry Night, O'Keefe in the Inner Brow, Van Gogh above pupil, Van Gogh in outer lid, Dali in the crease, and Dali in the bottom lashes. So Olympia. So maybe I'll even do one of these looks. And maybe I can try to do them all, recreate them all, um, and kind of make a series out of them. And I'll definitely be using this again. So, I mean, for those two items, I really, I'm not going to, I'm going to try them on. I'm going to try them again, and then I will reserve my judgment for that. Now, as for the rest of the um, products, I will definitely be putting this in my prize package or something. I will give this a shot. I do need body lotion. Um, this is for trouble skin, which, of course, is me. Um, this I will use with this video, and I mean, oh, I, thought, I got all excited. I thought it glitter in it, but it's just the powder all over it. So um, I am a big fan of nail polish, so I will give this a go. The only thing I find that with this, when I use it with my hardener, my nails never last as long. Um, what did I use? I used Pretty Woman nail polish, and then I used the Zoya uh, for my accent nails. Um, again, I don't know why, but they never last it as long as when I'm using the nails ink stuff and yeah so anyway I think this is a blue I accidentally spilt it all over the, the this so there's the color there kind of looks purple kind of looks blue I don't know I have to try it on so I'll try that in the next few days oh do you guys want to see what else I got today Oof, I've been waiting for this order I thought it was lost but it was not it was not. I don't even know what I ordered anymore. Oh, my headache is coming back. Oh, I can smell that nut polish. Oh, la, la, la. I think this is my Jeffree Star stuff. Well, I know it is. Well, they packed it nice. Just let me in, let me in, let me in. So I got my spearmint lip chops. No, I'm going to be using this next video. I'm going to get rid of some of this. Okay, guys. Bye, bud. Okay, so then I also picked up, did I really pick up four? I did. I don't think I picked up four. Maybe I did. I only thought, were these $15 each? I don't remember. <laughs> That's awesome that I don't remember. Okay, so I ordered starfish. This box looks like it's been open, so let's just hope it's not used. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm going to need a stand. Um, I got Baby Spice. Does he have the whole Spice Girls on there? Because I know he has Posh Spice. Oh. That does not scream my color. I don't know what does. Don't know why I just did that, but that is my color right there. I think I just found my new Holy Grail lipstick. I'm actually wearing L'Oreal's lipstick right now, and I don't really like it. So this is Beauty Pageant. I'm gonna have to go to his website and see. Look at that. It's got sparkles. 
Okay, guys, I just got bloodlust, so I am going to be using some of these with my bloodlust. Okay, and this one is Jeffrey's Girl. <laughs> I think all these colors will suit me. Okay, so there is that haul. I will be doing video on that sometime soon. Um, but yes. Um, okay, so like I said, you cannot get this box. So, but if you get the editor's box you might be able to get one of these items in it I'm kind of cheered up by what what I got I'm not gonna lie I was really disappointed when I did see the um, spoilers or what people other people had posted but I'm feeling a little bit better about things now that I've um, gave them a go I'm gonna have to have a shower tonight but anyway I can't thank you guys enough for watching and I know this is 25 minutes long I hope you guys have a great day also, if you guys could um, like, comment, and share on this video, what do you think of this box? Do you get it? Are you going to after this video or not? Don't forget to use my personal referral link um, just to let them know that you did see the video and that, uh, you know, you liked it and whatever. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have a great day.